Now, what is the evolution of IoT or evolution of Internet of Things? You can see first it was host to host, like one computer to another computer in our time when just uh, computer science arrived. At that time, with three or four people, we were having a local area network between our computer and some of my friend, he was sharing his hard disk. Some of our friend, he was sharing his printer. Some of our friend, he was sharing his uh, CD-ROM drive. Some of our me, I was sharing my floppy disk drive. It was like that. Okay, So we, we had a small network, host-to-host -host communication. And then internet came with limited access. Okay, we couldn't use internet very nicely. Okay, so host-to-host, -host, but there is a central control system or internet system. Okay, uh, and then the mobile internet came. Mobile internet came means, yes, we have existing internet connect with the, with the connections and the wireless connectivity. Okay, so it's it just evaluated in very few years in, in you can say 30, 40 years. Okay, so then the mobile device and how to say uh, uh, physical connection, both are working together. And after that, another new thing came, which is called people. That means the, uh, like we are also connected with the internet through some devices, like my, uh, what, what can I say? Mm. Like by using Facebook, okay, or using Twitter, or using uh, this kind of social media, we were also connected with the internet all the time. I am getting some notification on my phone. Okay, I am getting notification about something. Okay, so we also involved with the internet. In the internet become the uh, one of the most necessary item. Okay, if we say uh, five, the most necessary item, it becomes sixth necessary item. Okay, like even if you can think, if you go outside without a money bag, maybe it will not become a very big problem. You can ask some guy like give me some money, 100, 200 taka, then no problem. But if you forgot your cell phone, if you forgot your network inside your home and you go for work, it's impossible. Okay, so life become like that. Okay, we also become part of internet. And then are saying not only us, but also our devices, all the devices like my credit card, okay, my uh, kitchen, okay, my even the burner, okay, my 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 kids' toys, everything will be connected with my uh, this laser pointer, okay, my clock or my watch or my bracelet that will give me my health data, something like this, okay, these kind of things will be connected with the internet. That means the machine with the human also connected with the internet. They also become part of this connectivity. Okay, so very interesting evolution. Now this is the same, this, this is saying the software kind of evolution, like first it was human to human, like we are calling uh, by using phone or something like this, this kind of devices. And then WWW came, World Wide Web came, and we started sending email or we could watch some uh, uh, how to say, very, very plain, uh, rich text type uh, website. And then web 2.0, where all kind of things are connected with the web-based system. Like my, uh, you know, before some time back or before few years, we are, we are using different software for uh, email, okay? But you see, now we are using web email, okay? Before some years back, where we were using different software for uh, phone call, different software for even faxing, okay? But now, you see everything become web-based, okay? If you have the uh, Facebook on your computer, you, you can even call from the Facebook. You don't need to have any other app, okay? So, everything is become, we are saying multimedia web, okay? And then social media came. Social media came, you know, Facebook, as I told you on previous lecture, uh, previous slide. Okay, Facebook came, Twitter came, this kind of social media, YouTube came, this kind of social media came and we become connected with each other. Skype came, okay, we become connected with the internet and after that machine to machine. It's just uh, in previous slide we are saying hardwarely, in this slide we are saying software. Okay, so how to handle this thing, how to handle all these issues together, this is a very, very important part of 
IoT. Okay. Now we are going to show you X point of view. Like you can, if you see the, uh, uh, how to say, the, the picture, you can see any time, any context, the device can be connected, the device can communicate. Anyone, anybody can be connected with the internet, can be connected through their IoT device. Any service, any business, any service of any business, they will be able to use IoT device, okay, Internet of Things. Any path, any network, by using any path or using any network, our IoT device will be able to, how to say, communicate or transfer the data from one place to another, okay. Any place, anywhere, we'll be able to use our IoT device even in the kitchen, even with the toys, even in our pocket, even in the uh, t-shirt, even in the socks, okay, even in some cap, okay, even in the watch, even on the button, okay, even on the glass, so everywhere, okay, any place, anywhere we'll be able to use IoT. And then anything, any device, from here, here, my shoes, my, how to say, uh, tissue box, everything, okay, everything will be able to become the part of IoT. So, an in internet of things allows people and the things to be connected anytime, any place, with anything and anyone, ideally using any part of network and any service. That is the point of IoT. Now, characteristics of, uh, characteristics of IoT. We have mentioned seven characteristics of IoT here. One is connectivity. So, everything should be connected with each other. That is a very important point. That at least my devices, my things should be connected with my server. Okay, that are used for me. Secondly, intelligent. Okay, intelligence become very important part. Okay, my system, my IoT system or IoT framework should be, should have a, should, should be intelligent. Like as I told you, when I am arriving to my office, my air conditioner will start automatically. When I will, uh, I will get into my car, the car will be able to know intelligently where I need to go. And it will use the shortest path or the, uh, how to say, the, uh, the path is the, will, will use the less time for arriving to the office. Or maybe it will know how long it will, uh, or which, which path is the, whenever, whatever it is, it is longer or shorter, but it will, uh, uh, how to say, reduce the arrival time to my office. Okay. It will use the infrastructure of traffic. Okay. So, it should become intelligent. And then I said complex architecture on communication. So, as I told you, since a number of devices will be connected, this system will not become very simple. Okay, a uh, complicated, a number of different type of things will come. Like, like when subway will come, in subway, your mobile phone would not work. What to do? Okay, so they might, will create another type of network so that your mobile will first connect it with the uh, server or with the, with the connectivity inside the subway and then that device will be connected with the other, how to say, antenna on the platform and then the main antenna. Okay, in that way we might get connected. So, different type of connectivity will come, different type of network, different type of concept of building the network will come. Okay, so it will become a complex architecture, that's for sure. And then the things. Anything contains sensors or sensing material can be attached to the device and items. So anything that can sense, like if my flower was, okay, if that can sense whether the flower is all right or not, and then can tell me like now your flower become, if it's plastic flower, if it's say your flower become dirty, please clean it, I will clean it. It become, if it become the real flower, if it, uh, uh, how to say, uh, become rotated, then it might say me, 
throw it. Okay, I'll throw it. So everything, if it have the sensor, if it can sense the environment or surroundings, that can be part of IoT. That is the point. And then the time considerations. Okay. So we have to send this data to the server as soon as possible to generate the data. So the complexity of network. Okay. So we have to send every information with the time so that we can calculate like if there is a gas leak in my kitchen it should let me know what time the leakage was detected okay how much the fire occur okay if it can send the data the detailed data to the fire service office or in which floor my kitchen is or which corner if it send the building plan the floor plan of this building to the fire service office it might be excellent idea so in this way okay we have to make on right time real time okay that is the very important issue for iot device like if we don't consider the time if it become delayed like yeah i am coming home my air condition should be turned on but it was too slow like i entered in my home and still my air conditioner is not turned on no sense okay so size and space consideration scalability with localization like if we have some device size should be uh, how to say scalable like like maybe initially i am using my iot device only inside my home inside my pocket or inside my body or with my body and in my office but Maybe in some time, I need to, uh, how to say, expand the space. Like I might go to uh, Shiraz Gons in my home district, or I might go to Cox's Bazaar for my vacation. Okay. I also want to be connected with the system. So space should be scalable. Okay. In the same way, localization. Localization means where am I? Okay. Where my devices are? Okay. That things should be. Uh, well defined okay so that is the things of iot or characteristic of iot like size and space consideration lastly everything as a service is it free no okay the company giving me the service like i am using some sensors in my kitchen when it get the fire it will call 999 or it will call the fire service office automatically is it free should not be technology will not sustain okay so everything will become as a service so we have to maybe it will become free for a few days after that you have to pay or maybe uh, it will become free for few years after that you have to pay maybe you have to pay very little for each service or if you can buy a package so everything will become service so that financially it will become sustainable okay so that are the characteristic of iot